Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to fix bad sectors on a hard disk. Let's, let's go to our computer and we're going to launch our command prompt uh, from our desktop. Basically, uh, click on your start menu and uh, on Windows XP you go to run and type in CMD. Vista, I'm just typing that right here. Now you have to run this as an administrator on Vista, this command prompt. So I'm going to right click on the response and say run as administrator. Click continue. Now that I have a command prompt open and I'm running it as an administrator, I'm going to type the check disk command, chkdsk. And I'm going to check my C drive, so I'm going to say C colon, and then a space, and then a slash uh, F, which means uh, fix, um, fix problems that you encounter. So I'm going to run that, and that's going to tell me that it cannot run because the volume is in use by another process. It's going to ask me if I want to schedule this scan to run the next time the system restarts. I'm going to say yes by typing a Y and hit enter. Now, all I have to do now is restart my computer by clicking on the start button and going to restart. And when my computer boots back up, it's going to run a check disk um, system that's going to scan every single bit of my hard disk. And as it comes across bad sectors, it's going to flag those bad sectors um, as being unavailable. Now, it's important to note that any data that you had in those bad sectors is uh, pretty much irrecoverable. But this will cause Windows to be aware of those bad sectors and not use those in the future. My name is Dave Andrews, and I've just showed you how to fix bad sectors on a hard disk.